I'm actually down at the Cat Sanctuary today to say a fond farewell to our beloved snow leopard Kumbu just before he heads off to another zoo to find his perfect love. Kumbu's now old enough to start a family. He's part of a breeding program and has a female snow leopard waiting for him at another zoo. But before he goes, Tyler and Keeper Ricky are giving him a special parting gift. Hey, Kumbu. Oh, hello, beautiful. What have we got for you? Happy Valentine's. So you can see how excited he is already. Already by the fence, kind of eager to have his own little love heart. Let's go and do it. Right, so Ricky, the challenge now, where do we put them? Um, how about in his log pile? Oh, that's a good shout. Nice big heart for him. How about we pierce that through the top there? Perfect. All right, now what's next? So he loves different smells, so we've got a little bit of coffee for him. Hopefully they'll make them even more exciting. Oh, nice one. Cold coffee might seem a strange thing to give to a snow leopard, but he should love its strong smell. Oh, I do love coffee. I forgot to have one this morning as well, so... <laughs> Big cats use scent to communicate and love investigating new smells. So hopefully Tyler and Ricky's coffee-soaked hearts will go down well. It's completely safe for him to taste, and that rice paper piñata is edible too. Oh, a little robin. Oh. I think the robin likes the coffee as well. I think you can hear that sound. I think that's Kumbu running out of patience. So I'm going to get rid of the final bit of coffee and enjoy these love hearts. Kumbu could smell that already. I've just seen him rubbing his head on the mesh. Cool. All right, should we let him in? Yeah, let's go. Oh, looking around. Things you love to see. Great enrichment. Oh, brilliant. He absolutely loves his love heart. <laughs> I think he's destroyed the love heart now. Yeah, that coffee's done a good job. <laughs> he's rubbing it all over his cheek. He's a very confident little robin. Male robins are very territorial. And it looks like this one might want to steal Kumbu's heart. Do you reckon he's destroyed it so quickly just because maybe he thinks the robin was going to take it from him? Maybe. The robin was very, very interested. <laughs> he needs to just watch himself, though, because it is a big cat in there. Yeah. <laughs> in their mountain homes of Central Asia, snow leopards would usually hunt mammals like ibex and blue sheep. So this robin is probably too small to be on the menu. You're going to miss Kimbu when he's gone. Oh, definitely. I've been very lucky to look after him for nearly three years now, so we'll miss him, but I know he's going somewhere really fantastic. So next step now, going to have a new girlfriend? Yes, yeah. That'd be so exciting. Because snow leopards are a vulnerable species, everyone is keeping their fingers crossed that their new partnership will produce cubs. Hi, I'm Aaron, and I live here at the zoo. Now, to follow more of what my brothers and I get up to with our animal friends, download the free BBC iPlayer app to follow all of our wildlife adventures and to see all of your favourite CBBC shows.